Are you looking for an easy hearty meal? Let's make a Turkish style beef stew güveç with veggies. It is an easy one pot dish but to give an extra taste I'm going to stir fry the vegetables while the meat is cooking. It's going to be delicious. Let's make it. This is Ayşenur Altan. Welcome to my kitchen. I'm using cast iron white deep dish pan. It is well heated after drizzling about 4 tablespoons vegetable oil. I'm gonna saute 500 grams cubed beef chunks. After it begins to change its color, I drizzled a bit more hot water and going to cook until it is soft. I have 4 medium sized potatoes, 2 each, eggplants and zucchinis, couple of green peppers and onion. Beginning from the potato, I'm going to stir fry my veggies while my meat is cooking. I heated up another pan and added more vegetable oil. I'm just going to partially fry them to give extra taste to my dish rather than boil everything together. Checking my meat. First it was still somewhat hard. And I didn't have any water left, so I drizzled more water and continue to cook until it is soft. I don't want too much meat in my dish, so I put some of it to use in another dish. And now I'm gonna cut my onion and going to saute along with the meat. You can make your güveç using only fresh tomatoes if it's the season. If it's not, just use tomato paste or mix of tomato paste and puree. Now I'm gonna continue to build up my güveç, adding my partially fried veggies. Next I have my eggplants. I halfway peeled them and cutting into cubes. As you can see I add enough vegetable oil on each batch to cook barely my veggies. Here are the green peppers, these are sweet. I'm not gonna fry them in the second pan, going to add along with the onions. Adding some salt will help to cook the veggies. And you can always drizzle extra oil if needed. Also closing the lid will give some steam inside and make our veggies softer. Next I'm adding the zucchinis. Later I realized that if I would use a wok pan, it would have been better to shake the pan. Adding some coarsely chopped garlic to give a bit more taste. 
and here they meet with the others. When I filmed this dish, it still wasn't the tomato season, so I used a bit tomato puree and making sure to get the every bit from the pan. Drizzled some more hot water to barely cover the veggies. Adding some salt, oregano and to make it hot I'm gonna use these small peppers just adding one it will be enough because it's really hot I'm going to simmer everything until my veggies are soft gently stir and a check couple of veggies I think it shows itself the stir frying method doubles the taste and makes everything even more delicious and after resting for about half an hour my dish is ready I made this dish early in the morning and I knew how delicious it's gonna be so I wanted to film it was really easy to make and comforting to know that when you get back home a hearty meal will be waiting for you to enjoy with your family. You can serve it with Turkish rice or a bulgur wheat pilav. I have the recipes on my channel. Give it a try and I hope you enjoy it. Thanks for watching and see you next time. Afiyet olsun.